Hi guys and welcome to my channel from CNA to NP. This is the place to be if you are aspiring or currently a nurse assistant nurse or a nurse practitioner. My name is Lori and I'm a family nurse practitioner who started off working as a nurse assistant. Since this is my first YouTube video, I really wanted it to be a quick get to know me and a little introduction to my channel. Let's start off with my channel name, From CNA to NP. Pretty straightforward and I really wanted it to reflect my journey thus far and where I am right now in my career. So I started off in 2004 as a nursing assistant. I didn't go to school to become a nursing assistant. I was trained at a long-term care facility and I went on to work there, I think for three or four years, I moved on to the hospital after a while. So I worked as a nursing assistant for six years. While I was getting my prereqs done, while I was in nursing school, I continued to do so. I went to nursing school, I went straight to a university, and I graduated in 2010 with my bachelor's degree. After I graduated from nursing school, I went to work in the ICU of the same hospital that I was working at as a nursing assistant. Pretty much worked in the ICU as a bedside nurse for a total of seven years. I think after year two or year three, I kind of got the itch to go back to school and I essentially kept putting it off because honestly speaking, school is not my friend. I don't know about you, but school is definitely not my friend. Well, it, for me, nursing school was academically and emotionally challenging. So that's a big reason why I kept putting off going back to school for my master's degree. And it's so funny because I remember when I was in nursing school, I kept saying, Lord, please just help me to graduate and finish this program. I will not go back to anybody else's school. Look where I am right now. How many of you had that prayer when you were in nursing school? When you prayed to God to let you be finished with the program and you have went on to get advanced degrees? Comment down below because I know I'm not the only one. So I ended up going back to school. I obtained my master's degree in 2017 and I've been practicing now as a nurse practitioner for a year. So I work in primary care. Primarily, I see patients in a nursing home setting. I do sometimes go to the office and work, but I try not to do that a lot because a big part of my job is wound care and I do wound care three days a week. So it's kind of a lot. I also round in the hospital setting one week and a month. So I do feel like the job that I have, I am getting experience in a lot of different areas because I work in the office sometimes, the nursing home setting, I'm doing wound care, and I'm running in the hospital. Uh, for those of you who don't know, wound care is actually a specialty because right now I'm working on my wound care certification as an NP. I did not really want to do wound care, but I'll tell you in a later video how I even landed this job and why I took it. So that is pretty much what I'm doing right now, how I got from the CNA to the NP, and the purpose of my videos and the purpose of this channel is really to give you guys information, tips, things I wish I knew before I, I even embarked on nursing or NP. I really want to motivate, uplift, and encourage all of the future CNAs, RNs, NPs that are coming along. And even if you are currently a registered nurse and you're trying to go from nurse to NP and you're not quite sure, I will definitely be sharing with you guys some of the things I've learned along the way. I am a newbie NP since I've only been practicing for a year, but I can still share with you guys what I have learned so far in hopes that it will definitely help you on your journey. If you have gotten to this far on this video, thank you so much for watching until the end. Don't forget to click that subscribe button and that notification bell so you don't miss out on any of my content. I will be uploading once a week on Sundays, so I will definitely see you guys back here Thanks for watching and I'll see you in my next one. Bye guys.